DRS has a long history starting with Watkins Johnson. It's well over 50 years of creating really the swap optimized RF capability um, that is um, really required in today's environment. DRS plays a really important role for RF recorders, data collection systems, and RF front ends in both the DOD and the Intel community. We are the premier provider of this type of equipment. Our RF systems cover a wide range of uses because of their wide bandwidth and wide frequency coverage. Uh, traditionally, we were only common. Today, we are Comment, Elint, ESM, and now EW. There are a couple key differentiators of our tuners over their competitors. First, swap, size, weight, and power, um, but also key to that is performance. Uh, we cover a wide bandwidth over a large frequency range in a very small package um, where we have actually a very good balance between all the RF specifications. Vesper is the highest performing comment tuner on the market today. It covers two megs to six gigahertz with 100 megahertz of bandwidth, um, all contained in a very swap optimized package um, and there's several instantiations of it. Uh, no one comes close to a density and performance in that packaging. The Harrier is an HF system um, it sets actually the gold standard for HF systems in the marketplace today. Um, it has 4, 8, 12 and up coherency capability um, and it covers a complete spectrum, 30 megahertz um, at, uh, for each channel and so today that is unheard of in the industry. A Sparrow has a lot of different uses. Um, first we talk about it actually extends all the way down to 70 megahertz. It's Comment, Elint, RWR. In today's environment, RF is more important than ever to our customer. The RF spectrum is more congested than ever before with you know, 5G, the proliferation of cell cellular um, capability and networks with Wi-Fi. Um, so more than ever before, the capability of being able to detect a small signal in the presence of large signals um, is key to our warfighter having the advantage. So the role we play is, is key. We've actually been on the forefront of some of the standard committees, for example, VITA 49, VITA 67. Uh, the purpose of those committees is to create a level playing field for all the vendors out there so there's no proprietary hardware, no proprietary lock-in. Uh, that's key. DRS has been really driving that, on, been in the forefront of that effort uh, for at least the last 18 years.